what I would just wanted to say for this introduction is that I would um, 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 I would suggest uh, for for the, the time being for my presentation to go from the question of children's uh, children's well-being at school to the question of um, uh, children's attitudes towards school. Um, as a more uh, first ethnographical, uh, I'm not a quantitativist, so I will uh, speak to you and present to you uh, some uh, ethnographies of school rather than uh, quantitative studies. Uh, more ethnographical, more um, 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 uh, fo f focused on practices than on uh, declaration of liking or declarations of liking, uh, if you will, and I will come back to, to that in the conclusion. Um, and also something, as, I, uh, as I've already said, as something that is more class-based. Children's attitude towards school, uh, to me, it's clear that when you use this phrase, you have the, the idea that it is uh, situated in the social space of attitudes, uh, that you have uh, working class attitudes, middle class attitudes, and even uh, more uh, subtle uh, um, uh, fraction, class fractions, attitudes, and, and this is what, what I will be uh, talking about. Um, so um, ethnographies, class, and, and uh, um, uh, focused on uh, practice. Uh, what, uh, what are my problems with the question, do you like school? So just to sum it up, uh, the fact that uh, the question is uh, historical, uh, uh, historically situated, and that we 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 use it as a an historical question when you when we ask it. Uh, and I also uh, thought about uh, talking about new pedagogies, but uh, let's do that another time. Um, the decorative parts I mentioned earlier. So the fact that uh, uh, it's. To me, as an ethnographer, it's much better to go into the classroom and, 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 and do interviews and to ask uh, this kind of question that can will uh, bring answers um, that students think they have to give uh, sometimes, or just uh, kind of uh, representations of school. And I just wanted to uh, uh, rem remind uh, you uh, what uh, the, um, the, the Adler and Adler did about uh, the, uh, showing on, on popularity, showing that, for, for example, for boys, you're not supposed to like school after primary school. It's uncool. So you've got to say that you don't like school uh, if you're asked if you like school, for example. But you can, uh, uh, I, I, I think, I do think that when you're asking this specific question, you're also um, um, uh, receiving the representation of the question itself among the, the youngsters and the fact that some of them will say that they like or don't like school for other reasons that the true uh, uh, Really? reasons of their heart. Uh, and, and finally, so uh, I'm not so sure about the question, the fact, to, the, the fact that we ask it. Uh, the, do you like school? I think that the you is a much too homogeneous uh, well, uh, pronoun, as I, have, I, I, I have tried to show with the class-based uh, uh, thing. Uh, like um, is not a verb I would uh, prefer uh, compared to the uh, question of practical attitudes and dispositions. Uh, it's a very external, and, 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 and I think that the, the, the reality of the question lies in practical and, and incorporate in practices and incorporated disposition. So, and school, finally, uh, once again, it is a too homogeneous. And, and as I, I wanted to do more on Paleta and the vocational school. Mm. But do you like school? I, it depends on which kind of school. And, and, and so um, I think it would be interesting to have a very precise uh, a notion of <coughs> what school they're talking about when they say they like it or not. Vocational school, a school in uh, rural France, a school in ZEP, uh, or well, this kind of a, um, a social connotation of the school itself. And I also wanted to, but I will stop at once uh, after that, I promise. Um, I wanted to, to, to say maybe that the question, do you like school, 
uh, cannot be raised uh, without the question, does school like them? And this is uh, something I <laughs> wanted to say. It's a bit of a tragedy, but uh, still, I think it's necessary. Um, and also to uh, ask whether the fact that uh, children in France don't like school when they answer this question uh, could be related to something that you, you Claude, you, you said also in your introduction, the fact that um, uh, when it comes to social inequalities uh, in school, France is uh, not in the top tier also, so maybe there is something uh, in these two uh, not being in the top tier uh, of uh, Occidental countries uh, that could be connected somehow. So.